What is going on guys, my name is Moto and today you're going to be watching some MMAX vs ATV Supercross Encore here today on my channel. Uh, now we got a couple of things to talk about today and uh, so yeah let's I guess just jump right into it and uh, the first thing that I'm going to say is that I am slightly pissed off. Um, some of you guys may know a couple of things that have happened which is the reason for this video. Um, some of you guys probably don't. Actually, most of you guys don't know the first thing that I'm pissed off a little bit about. Um, is that would be, uh, that, uh, Feld tried to strike my channel. Um, yes, they tried to strike a, a live stream video. Um, and made it so that, uh, the video went down. Um, luckily I found out because, uh, one of the viewers here, uh, you know who you are. I don't, I, I don't fully remember your username or I would have, uh, would have said your name um but one of the viewers um pointed it out in a comment on another video that uh one of my uh, uh live streams was actually taken down by feld and um i'm very happy that you did do that um really quickly if you guys ever do see a video on my channel um that says it's been taken down due to copyright reasons or anything of that sort please let me know because if um, unless i've already addressed it um or 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 I don't even really know, to be honest. Just comment it and say, hey, this is down by copyright reasons. Um, because I don't really check my emails much, and that's how YouTube notifies you. Um, and I don't check my, um, my my video manager, which is also what can can notify me of recent videos, at least. Because I that's, that's where you can see um, all the recent videos and, and scroll through. So, um, without checking my emails I wouldn't have known that I actually had uh, Feld attempting to copyright strike me luckily I was gonna take the video down anyway uh, just cuz just like I think like a, a 25 minute live stream maybe even a 16 minute live stream for one race and then we were heading over to GTA 5 um, but regardless it was a copyright strike attempt they didn't strike the channel uh, nothing was gonna happen to my channel just yet um, just because the strike wasn't really a I guess I don't even know it was kind of because there's claims, um, and then there are, are claim like, so there's normal claims where it's like, okay, um, you just can't monetize it, which that's fine. Um, and then there's also claims where you get the audio muted, and then there's video claims um, where it makes it so that you literally, like, they take your, your video down. And that's kind of what happened to me, and that's like the, the highest claim you can get before a strike. Um, which can also result in a strike, I guess, uh, from what I'm understanding. Um, so I, I've taken that video down anyway, so the, the, there is no possibility for me to get a strike. And if there is, I'll just dispute it because one, the video is not up and I own the content rights to that since it is original content uh, that I do own the rights to. Um, so again, thank you for the man who decided to, uh, to comment and tell me, hey, you have a, a video that has been striked. You have a strike. Like, why do I have a strike? So thank you very much for doing that. If you guys ever see a video down like that based on copyright reasons, let me know in a comment on in a recent video, on like a new video um, that has, has come out and all that good stuff. So uh, on to the second reason why I am extremely pissed. Now this is actually, this is what really, really sets me off. Um, and as you guys know, about a week ago, maybe a little bit more, actually I think it was about a week ago, um, I got an offer from motor from the developers of motor racer 4 um and they they gave me the offer and they were like okay so here's what what we're gonna do we're gonna send you a free game and what you're gonna be able to do is you're gonna make a video on it and review it and then we're gonna send you codes for a giveaway um and so i made the video yeah, I, I think I did a pretty solid review. I think I did a really good review. The review seemed to be very nice towards them. Um, kind of showed off the best parts about the game. Um, and so they said, okay, and they, they emailed me and they were like, okay, so you need to make the video and then link us the video. So I linked the video. All good. Everything's good. Um, and at this point, I didn't have the codes for the giveaway yet. Um, and so... I send them it, and about two days later, it took them literally two days to respond to me from the link. So I was like, okay, what's going on? Uh, they say, awesome, thanks, cool. It's the last thing I've heard from them. So guys, unfortunately for you, it actually this actually makes me look really bad. Um, I don't have codes to give away yet. 
I'm going to give it a couple of days because maybe they're just running busy or, or something. Um, I'm going to give them a couple more days uh, to send me codes for the giveaway so I can actually select the winners and give those codes out to you guys. Um, but if it comes to fruition that they're just going to kind of jip me, which in a sense, I mean, I did get a free $60 to $40 game, whatever it is, from them. Um, but in my opinion, it's jipping me because, one, I, I it makes me look bad, I guess, in a sense. It... it it makes me look like, oh, well, I just wanted subs and, and comments and revenue and all this stuff. And that's not what I'm about. I'm about getting you guys the best content and all that stuff and, and helping you guys out. Um, so if they don't send me the codes, I'm just, I don't know. I'm going to figure something out. You guys are going to get something at least. It, it's it. I don't know exactly what it's going to be yet. Um, it might be a random random like it literally could be anything random like i don't even i have no idea um let me give me ideas down below in the comments nothing too radical um because i don't I, i'm i'm not necessarily a rich man i can't go out and buy a bunch of stuff but if if need be i'll go out and and get something from like gamestop or, or something of that sort for you guys um or maybe i'll i'll do a live stream like it, like i don't know I could do probably like a 24-hour live stream. I can try to do a 24-hour live stream. If that'd be interesting to you guys, if that's what you'd like me to do instead of the giveaway. I don't know. I still want to give you guys something, um, but I, I don't know. I'm, I'm a little pissed off because, um, you know, while, while I'm getting a free game and all that stuff, and in reality I didn't have to do a giveaway and all that stuff, um, when I announced the giveaway, I was excited because of the fact that I was going to be a better interaction with you guys and uh, plus this is me actually giving back for your support um, but you know I'm being gypped so I'm, I'm I'm a little bit pissed that's why that's why I think I'm being gypped is because I can't give away something to you guys um, and you guys aren't receiving content that I thought I was going to be able to deliver and that's never been how I've been trying to go about on YouTube. I've always been about the viewer, actually. Uh, my motto when I first started was uh, make videos uh, from the viewer perspective and and at, uh, answer questions that I would an like I would have uh, being a viewer. Uh, don't answer questions that are just common and, and obvious. I mean, obviously common questions I'd answer, but uh, don't answer those just constantly. If there's a video out there and, and and somebody's asking a question on that video and it's not being answered, answer that question. Go in and find the extra valuable questions that some people have uh, that are not being answered and answer them. So I've always had that viewer mindset and and I, I that's, that's why I wanted to do this stuff for you guys. Um, so uh, that's why I think I'm being gypped because I want to give back to you guys for supporting me and showing me the love that you guys do. Um, we're at 275 subs. I, I've been meaning to make a video for 200 subs in and of itself. Actually, I think I made a 200 sub video. But I was me I've been meaning to make a 250 sub video for a long time. Not actually, it wasn't a long time. It was three days ago when I was at 250. You guys have been helping me grow for like just so quickly, and I'm loving the I'm loving the support that you guys are giving me. So anyway, guys, uh, I'm sorry if that was a little bit of a rant, but it, it kind of just pisses me off knowing that I'm not going to be able to give back to you guys exactly what I promised. But I swear to you, there will be something. Um, if you have any ideas that aren't just crazy extreme. Or like the idea of that 24-hour live stream, which I'll probably do a 24-hour live stream regardless of whether you guys are interested in that. Because I'm a loser and I might as well. I have nothing better to do. Um, so that's my plan. Um, if you guys have any, any ideas at all, comment down below and let me know. Um, if you enjoyed this video or, or found any of the information useful to you or or have any feeling towards anything or, or like the video in general like the gameplay hit that like button uh comment down below what you're excited for and again comment ideas for a giveaway uh down below in the dis or in the comments uh, i am gonna wait a couple of days though because they might be giving me the codes late and you know if they do that that would be really nice um 
So yeah, guys, if you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. I'm going to leave my Twitter and the squad gamer tags as well as mine down below in the description. And as always, guys, my name is Moto, and I'm out. Peace.